G'day everyone, the Aussie adventure begins. We left cold, rainy Baddow Bay and headed up to Bundaberg to stay with our friends Rob and Jess who live at Bagara, which is by the sea, lovely little town. The ocean was crystal clear, too cold to swim because it's their winter and we spent four days relaxing and then we headed off on our camping holiday in earnest. We drove over the Great Dividing Range, which was 70 kilometres of dirt because we took the wrong road, and we joked about pushing the car. Little did we know that that would become reality. You see, at this point in time, the car was running badly. I mean, it was it was running badly before we left, but now it was far worse. And we said to ourselves, no more dirt roads. Anyway, after a day's drive through beautiful countryside, we hit our destination, finally. G'day everyone, I'm Wayne Dowson from Wayne Dowson Fine Art and I'm on location in a small town called Biloela and it's in central Queensland. We've been here for four days a little longer than what we planned due to some slight mechanical difficulty with our famous red rocket, our Toyota Corolla, which incidentally I had to push over the Great Dividing Range. We went for a lovely 15k walk around Biloela, checking out the farms and countryside. It was lovely. We even met, we even made some friends. And then we got up early one morning for a 170k drive to Kroombat National Park. And yep, there was more dirt to come. The countryside was spectacular, all lovely farmland. I took heaps and heaps of photos of the cattle and the odd bull that we came across. Unfortunately, we couldn't get all the way in to the National Park. There's actually a B-24 Liberator that's, uh, that was crashed in there 50 years ago. And I wanted so badly to see it. But the, re the little red rocket didn't have the needed power to get up the last hill. So we were about 10k out. So we had some morning tea. We turned tail and headed back down the valley. And the, the views were spectacular. They really were. It was a beautiful, beautiful day. And yep, we even did some water crossings. A little red rocket. When it's pointing down, it's not too bad. And we tried to do a trade-in for the red rocket, but it wasn't to be. It was a no-go. The farmer was too smart. So the sun went down on Biloela and we headed to Emerald.